the dignity of the Kenyan worker will be restored when the economy is working and thriving. The president is passionate about reviving the economy of this country. So by you coming to support him, you are on the same wavelength. And we were wondering then, the people you are telling us to support had destroyed the economy of this country. So where was the Kenyan worker to be placed? But now that God in his own mercy and grace sorted out the situation, the president is here, you are here. We have a matter of convergence. Please support the president to revive the economy and it's good for the Kenyan worker. Two things, Your Excellency, that I would like to request these union leaders to work with you. Affordable housing. It is a dream of every urbanite to own a home in the town or in the city. That is a dream of any Kenyan worker. Even myself, when I came to work in Nairobi at the age of 22, I wanted to own a home and I own one. Every worker would like to own a place they call their own. The program of affordable housing is good for the Kenyan worker. The president has embarked on a program of where a worker can pay between four, five, up to 10,000, live in a house, and in 15, 20 years, own that house. Please support that program. It's good for the Kenyan worker. <laughs> Number two, the president is passionate about matter savings. The only way a worker will live well in retirement is if they embark on saving. So again, we want to appeal for your support that we need to bring the culture of saving among the Kenyan workers and the Kenyan people.